think you're gonna manage them all the way to a title? A father with a dream. You gotta try, you gotta want it! Three sons with a future. It's my time, Pop. You wanna go run to somebody else? A fight. Who got you there? No one wants to lose. I did what I know how to do so that you and your brothers could maybe have something that I never could have. Price of Glory, rated PG-13. See the new girl? Yeah. The in crowd. We can go in here and get as crazy as we want. They bring new meaning to rich. You would kill in that dress. Sexy. I don't know her. She's not your friend. And drop dead gorgeous. If I brought you in, I can easily throw you out. If only she would go away. <laughs> the in crowd. Look for it on video cassette and DVD. The year 2018, the place, a world where they buy your body parts for cash. White Core wants to be certain that you understand the gravity of the contract. And when the bill is due, you pay with your life. Find him and kill him. Don't you get it? You're the prize. Welcome to the future, where the cost of living is death. Eric Roberts, Carrie Elwes, and Sarah Winter, Race Against Time. Look for it on video cassette and DVD.
Her name was Onetta Doria, to be forever known as the Lady of Lesvos. She led her people to a historic victory over the Turks, but she died of wounds she received in battle shortly thereafter. This map fetched two million dollars in auction this week by no less of a notable collector than Elgin Q. Bates. Any questions? Yeah, Miss Spencer. Isn't the icon of Artemis just a myth? I mean, unlike the Colossus of Rhodes or the Metaphys of Olympia, no one's actually seen the statue. That's a good point, Claire. But unlike the Colossus, which was 40 feet tall and kind of hard to miss, the icon is only about this big. And the followers of Sappho guarded it fanatically for over a thousand years. My research says it is real. I'll stand by that until someone proves me wrong. You go, girl. <laughs> Okay, that's all. Enjoy your break. Hey, the finals are two weeks after you return, so read your Herodotus. I hope you get to prove that Artemis theory someday. Oh, thanks, Nikos. But don't hold your breath. It's not likely to happen. That's okay. You'll still be my favorite professor. <laughs> Let me up with this. Oh. Thanks. I meant what I said about the Artemis theory. You should do some field research. You'll probably be a full professor before I get up enough nerve to fly to Greece. Oh, you're really that scared to fly? Terrified. Well, that's too bad. I was going to say, you could fly home with me to Greece. I've got a lot of frequent flyer miles. Well, you know, I'd love to, Nikos. Oh, but could you hold this for a second? Guess not. Thanks, Maggie. Send him in. Queen's pawn, Queen's four. Queen's gambit. Welcome back. Was the trip successful? swore to protect it with his life. How did you get it? I, um... I took him up on his pledge. See the way you are. You, my friend, are a thing of beauty. Ah. Oh. <laughs> I know. Thank you, Crowley. Oh, Artemis, my beloved, beloved Artemis, I have you now. I have you now. Time yet, sir. You know what? Let's let it build. I want to test this new flange shield. Yeah, well, Captain Morris wants to know what time we're going to open the valves. Hey, Carl. Army Corps of Engineers built this thing. What's the matter? Don't you trust us? I was just asking, John. You know the specs better than I do. All right, we'll just let her build a little while and we'll pop the cord. Your call. Somebody in the flood channel. What? They're right in front of gate C. Give me three minutes. 
but it's not gonna hold. Damn kid out of there, or she's gonna be crushed by 70,000 pounds of water. Hey! Get out! Get out! to find you a new fishing hole. Okay. Hello? It's me. Hey. Honey, how are you? Listen, we have to talk about something. When are you coming home? Uh, they've asked me to stay another week. But you promised me this time. I know, and I know that you're still upset that I missed Christmas, but I, I, there's just nothing I can do about it. Fine. I'm just going to have to get used to not having you around. So, John, I've been thinking about taking some time for myself. What do you mean? I've been offered a chance to go to Greece. I think I might take it. Okay. Hey, John. I'm going to have to call you back. I just can't talk about this right now. Perfect.
Okay. Bloody Manchester United cost me a thousand pounds. Hey, 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 John and Chloe. Please leave a message and... Liz, hi, it's John. I'm fine, how are you? Uh, listen, do you know where Chloe's staying in Athens? Great, thank you very much. Anything to declare, sir? Yes. I have official clearance at the highest level. There should be no reason for any delay. Si no me alento. Mr. Crowley. Yes. Mm -hmm. There has been a change in the government uh, since this document was issued. The party who authorized the release of this item is no longer in power. Well, that's impossible. I had lunch with your prime minister only two days ago. We do enjoy a somewhat turbulent form of parliamentary governance. That's just not right. Um, that 
statue's my property. I paid for it. We had a deal. The bastard's broken. Where's the statue now? I'm told it's being shipped back to Lesbos. <clears throat> Do I have to spell this out to you? That statue belongs to me, Mr. Crowley. I want it. I want it. I understand. Good man. It's me. I need a dozen men. Athens Hilton, please. Keep that. Hi. Hello. I'm meeting my wife, Chloe Spencer. I need a room number. She's already checked out, sir. She's checked out? Yes, yes. I booked her and another guest on a ferry to the island of Lesbos. Down to Lesbos? Yes. Okay. Um, um, okay. Uh, is the ferry left? Not yet. It leaves from Piraeus in uh, 15 minutes. All right. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Adio. Ferry to Lesbos, please. Go around the yeah, Thank you. Hey! 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 Hey!
for our ticket. Hey, Chloe, you better be on the ship. What's wrong? Oh, I'm sorry, Nikos. Oh, my life's just such a mess. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh, it's okay. I'm sorry, I don't speak Greek. Uh, your ticket, sir, please. You know, I think I just left out in my stateroom. Uh, passport. It's a very long story. Come with me, please. Sir, please, come yeah, with me. You know, I, that's, can I just talk to... Chloe? No, 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 Chloe! sir, please, please, come with me. Please, yeah, come with me, please. I just, she's right there, please. I just, like, I just... Did you hear something? No. Well, I thought I... Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. Could you get me some orange juice instead? Of course. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, yeah, okay. I'm sure. Joseph εδώ δεν έχει εισιτήριο για βατήριο τίποτα. Αμερικάνο. Yeah. You have no passport. No ticket, no luggage. I'm afraid that's right. You are American. This you can prove? Oh, yeah, no. I'm John Spencer. How do you do? Um, I got money. Oh, uh, oh no. <laughs> do oh, not try. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I, was, I wasn't trying to bribe you. I was just, you know, I have money to buy a ticket. Mm, we must see your passport. Otherwise, you must be taken into custody. My wife is on the ship. Here, here, this is, we saw her. Remember, she was, she was, Standing out with that gentleman. 
Hmm. This is your wife. That's right. She's very beautiful. Oh, yes, she thank is. you. Perhaps you can find this woman. In Daxi. Her name is Chloe Spencer. Now, I'm sure if we find her, then we can figure all, all this out. In the meantime, stock a bit more. You will be our guest. I'll be your guest? Yes. I got it. Oh, I'm very cunning. Excuse me, Stuart. Ah, oh, yes. Can I help you, please? Mm. Don't move. Take me to your bridge, please. Can I help you? Actually, yes. Um, I'd like to take command of this ship. Questions? Yeah, it's Paula here. What? This is Aris. The ship. Is ours. Be prepared to rendezvous in 30 minutes. Copy that? I copy that. My men will be ready. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Locked. Mm. Really? The keys. The Xero. You sure about that? Now this 
is your new heading. Make sure he follows it. Get out of the way. Get out of the way! Aries, this is Phobis. You copy? Go ahead. I think we've got a problem. steam shower on this boat. Yeah. Uh, this Greek custom. In my hometown on Lesbos, we have wonderful mineral baths. I'm going to go get some coffee. Do you want anything? No, I'm fine, thanks. Okay. you too. Obviously, you and I have a lot to talk about. But right now, we have to find a way off this ship. What? <sighs> Honey, there are terrorists on this ship, and I think they've hijacked it. John, are you sober? I'm not kidding. And you probably should get dressed. A second honeymoon. <laughs> ah. Now, where the hell are they? To see you, boss. <sighs> Good work. There are two Americans in room 116. I want you to find them and deal with them. Understand? The 
captain is dead. Believe me, I know. I took the keys off of his body to get out of the room they locked me in. Are you sure that's what happened? Yes, I'm sure. I don't know why they're here, but they're here. You know, be honest, John. You came halfway around the world because you don't trust me. That is ridiculous. I tr you, know, you know, maybe I shouldn't trust you based on what I've seen today. What are you talking about? What, just because I want some excitement in my life? Some memories worth sharing with our children? If we ever have any. No, that is ridiculous, because you know that I want a family. A family means a mother and a father who's there, John. Okay, just st come on. Let's go. Come on. Hey, I'm sorry. I can't find my white shirt. Here, here. This is the shirt you're going to wear. That one. are not in their rooms. Don't waste any more time. Go directly to engineering. Copy. On my way. Move it. Yeah, we're in a position to make the exchange. All right, no, no, the ship is, uh, it's drafting too shallow. Well, we can't make the exchange at this, uh, this depth. Increase your ballast so that the ship is sitting about 10 feet lower in the water. We'll fix that. Tell them to fill the ballast. Do it! Do it! Captain, get to not so easy for me, mind you, just so that you could show up and drag me around like a cave woman. If you think there are soldiers on this ship, if I could find them, I could just let them handle this. Are you sure about these terrorists, John? I mean, I'm not saying that you're lying, but couldn't you be overreacting? Honey, this is me. Do I have an overactive imagination? Sometimes I think you have no imagination at all. Well, there you have it. You used to be adventurous, John. You remember our honeymoon? We went skinny dipping on that public beach at night. Yeah, you got stung by a jellyfish. It was exciting then. You were exciting. Now, whenever I do see you, it's the same routine. Dinner, TV, and a quick roll in the sack. Quick? You know what I mean. No, I, I just didn't know that I was quick. And I like my job, John. But it's no substitute for a real life. I would love to sit and chat about this. We have to go. Chloe! All right. We're okay. Finally. Yeah. Launch the mini sub. Sub is on its way. Everyone get in position in five minutes. Turn your cell phone.
are they doing? I don't know. They ain't selling Girl Scout cookies. Gracias. What's up? Gracias. boys? They are not. They are not. They are Mayday. Mayday. Vessel in distress. We have armed terrorists on board. Don't mind this. It's, a, it's an Air Force joke. How can you spot? How can you spot a Greek airplane? Hmm? Mayday. Mayday. Vessel in distress. She's got hair under the wings. <laughs> There's a fisherman. He wants to know where we are. Tell him we're the ferry to Lesbos, three hours outside of port. He must say to Mitalini Apollo. Que pama yatin Lesbos. Tres horas exo. Eropli echo ne pare to plio. Tela me volithia. Tora. Tora. Who is he? Stoplio. He told me something else. He said to me that the ship, look out, he said the ship's going to sink in five minutes. You're going to be kidding. How do we get off? He said, use the truck. It must be necessary and a force you to cut a strama or hechnimos. What, what, what do you say? He, he wanted to know where we were on the ship. I told him. What? Shit, go! We gotta stand the whole time with the truck.
I'm making a move. I'm going to the case. Watch out for that truck. It's loaded with explosives. Yeah, no, don't you worry about me. in the case. Oh my god. Suitcase. Get all the passengers off this ship now. Go! We're going back down. Watch your head. Are we sinking, John? No, the bulkheads can withstand 10,000 psi, so even the ship fills with water, we're okay. But we're not going to sink, are we? I seriously doubt it. Well, who 
is this woman and how did she get my statue? She just picked up the case. We're not sure why. So she understands the value of the icon? We're working on that. And the guy who the hell is he? Well, my instincts tell me he's had some kind of military background. Probably a pro. Well, that's your, your specialty, Crowley, unless you lied on your resume. I guarantee my work. You'll get what you paid for. I expect no less from you. I'll take care of it. Personally. How's the weather down there? Look, I don't know what your plan is, but my wife and I are not a part of it. You seem like a smart bloke. Let's not play any games. You give me the statue and I'll let you both go. Otherwise, you just have to stay where you are, won't you? Fine. Where do we meet? Well, he must be somewhere under the bow, or otherwise you would have drowned. Where exactly are you, John? Um... Engine room C. The strongest bulkheads. Smart. There's an escape hatch 30 yards ahead of you. Can you make that? We'll find it. See you soon, Johnny. No! We can't let them have it. It's a national treasure. It belongs to the people of Greece. Trust me, if the people of Greece were in this position, they'd understand. Come on. Mistakes. Hey. My men are in position, okay? John, I can't believe you won't consider my feelings on this. This is my life's work. All right, here's a little Greek. It's from a guy named Archimedes. An object will remain buoyant until the level of gas no longer exceeds the displaced level. So we're sinking. Bingo. Is everyone in place? Almost. Give me two more minutes. We'll be in position in one minute. Get in place and wait for my command. This doesn't make sense. The icon is valuable, but they can't really sell it. And there are only a few collectors in the world who would even attempt to. Oh my god, it has to be Elgin Bates. He's been obsessed with the icon for years. Looks like he's gonna get it. comes out besides me, kill them. What's wrong with Hubby? He's dead. What happened? 
I, I don't know. He just collapsed. Move away from the body. Here, this is what you want. Just come and get it. Move. Move. If he's already dead, one more bullet isn't going to hurt him, is it? Remember me. Throw the gun down and give me the case. Throw down the gun. Now give me the case, Johnny. Let her go first. No, 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 no. You give me the case first. <laughs> Five minutes to set the charges. You got three. Now go, go. All the way down. Maybe, maybe. 
the other side. We're going back to home base. Copy that. On my way. pounds per square inch, it's roughly 90 feet. You're joking, right? The gauge isn't moving, so we've either hit something or we're just on the bottom. If you just find another way out of here, we could probably swim for it. John, I want to tell you why I took this trip. John. Let's go ahead.
you raise the mini sub? <laughs> Oi! Can you raise the mini sub? It's an open frequency, sir. Just do it. That, that, that means that anybody can hear our transmission. You think you can operate this thing? <sighs> I read an article once. The mini subs are popular mechanics. Yeah. How bad could it be? Triton? This is Ares. Do you have the package? Over. I repeat, Triton. Do you have it? Over. I'm sorry, but Triton and Associates no longer with us. Bollocks! That yak's got more lives than a bloody Irishman. Try that red oxone button. This one. It's not doing anything. Like the one next to it. Well, I gotta hand it to you, mate. You are a stubborn little git, but I'm still gonna kill you. Seems to me you already had your chance, and I'm sorry I never got your name, mister. Well, since we're on an open transmission... I'm not gonna talk about that. But, um, I will remember not to make that mistake. Yeah. You know, I hope Elgin Bates isn't paying you much, because you are without a doubt the most incompetent... person I have ever seen. A man of Elgin Bates's wealth only hires the best, you bastard. I'll get the statue back. And in the process, I'm going to enjoy killing you and that little wifey of yours just for the, for the sheer pleasure of it. The one next to it. Nothing. Shit. You know, I know who you are. You're just some whiny reject. That's from Her Majesty's Secret Service. Is this really any way to repay some nice American couple? Because without us, they'd be speaking German on your island. Piss off! Maybe he's angry. He's more likely to make a mistake. You are dead. Dead! Sir, we've got something down here. Do we have any torpedoes? He's just trying to piss you off. If you start firing torpedoes, you're going to destroy everything, including the statue. Excuse me. This is a decommissioned sub. They don't just throw in torpedoes with it. Do you understand this? You see, Rob? Everything's fine. They removed the warheads. So, um, first of all, we'll just give them a bit of a scare. And then we'll ram the bastards. Hey, hey! Come here. Now, I'm in charge of the submarine. And I don't think our boss would appreciate it if we started ramming into things on purpose. You understand this? I will take care of Bates. You. You just see if you can get this old piece of shit up and running. All right. Lieutenant. Open it up. Again. Full speed ahead, Lieutenant. Again.
All right, we gotta get out of here. Get this thing going. I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay, we need more juice. Approaching an underwater canyon, we don't have the maneuverability that they do. Well, then fire a torpedo. That should scare them slow. Do we have a solution to the target? We have a solution. time on the torpedoes. I got another torpedo. No, it's too big. It's a battery. They're losing speed. Random. Round them again. Hey, back off. Didn't you understand me? We do not have the maneuverability to chase them. Now, you are nuts. Half speed. Hold that order. Hold this. This is my submarine, and I am the commander. You're in command here. You bet. You're in command here. Back off. I hate whiners. Full power. Are you? Out of your goddamn mind. I'm in this for the money. Not a goddamn suicide mission! Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut up! Oh. Now, gentlemen. You have a choice here. I can shoot you all and try and run that submarine myself, but that's probably not a very good idea. Or you can follow my orders and take a chance in splitting $100 million once we find that statue. Now, that's probably a better idea, isn't it? That's the spirit. Fire another torpedo. Sir, may I ask why? Because they will run their batteries down trying to outrun it. But, sir, in a canyon this tight, a torpedo could obscure our sonar. Just do what I said. Fire number two.
God, now what's wrong? We did in the water. Dead in the water. Ram the bastards. The torpedo is obscuring the oh, sonar. Geez. We have to pull off. I can't see in front of us. I said ram them, and don't you dare change course. Move! I'm glad I made the trip. If you can't match or beat Hong Kong's rate, what are you going to give me instead? Excuse me, Mr. Bates. Maggie, I ask not to be interrupted. I'm sorry, Mr. Bates, but there are two men here to see you. I'm in the middle of an important meeting. Have them wait. I'm sorry. They're from the FBI, sir, and they have a warrant. <laughs> what seems to be the problem, gentlemen? Uh, can I help you? What is the problem? Exciting enough for me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm proud of you. You too. And we saved the icon. Hey, so what's this big thing you've been trying to tell me? Yeah. <laughs> 